Welcome back everyone to the channel. Welcome back to the channel 16 and today's video is we're next to Zion for War Day 4. 38 to 17 versus Bangladesh and they are on the, the back end. So we we really were hoping for perfect war but um Farfleet ended up falling short by 6%. It was tough. It was tough especially falling by 6%. Um, but let us let us see if we can get a triple. Let's see if we can make it better and have a closer perfect war and that hopefully be able to just fall short by one. But it's like I said, it's okay. It was pretty close. Like he got so so close to getting that triple. Um, but let us hopefully try to triple on our own. Hopefully we can actually triple and not fall short. So this is the base of beginning um a town sixteen. And what we're gonna do on this base is we're gonna do really super archers because the super archers really world has been doing really well. So why not why not just stick for, for a little bit longer? So what we're gonna do is we're running some loons as well as battle them with the Grand Warden's ability over on this side. I would freeze the sweeper because I think I'll just freeze the sweeper just to not worry about it. So we'll freeze the sweeper. And I want to hopefully get the blimp like around here, I guess, right, right here. And then with double clone rage and whatever value you can get, we will go for it. And then on this side, we will start our main army, depending if the town hall doesn't go down. If the town hall doesn't go down, I'll run on this side. If the town hall does go down, I'll hit the queen um, head on. Basically, that's how it's going to go. I have healers with this army as well. So, well, yeah, I have healers with this army. For, the, for this style, and we will go from there. So, Baby Dragon and uh, Baby Dragon will come here. I'll probably drop Sneakies first, and then Baby on this one, and then we'll run our way through. And we would we we'll go with it, go with it as, it as it goes, I should say. Not not much, much plan, I guess, but just something different, I, I should say. So, if that's some of them, you guys see the base, you see the army, you can always want to do. It's crashing and there are a lot of holes in the base too, so it's something you can take advantage of if, if I say so myself. So loans down. Um I'm gonna change the warden to ground. I don't have the rage gem, I forgot. I don't I didn't change it I sometimes forget I have to change equipment. I hope it's not I hope it's just me that forgets to change equipment. Hopefully I'm, hopefully it's not just me, I guess. Hopefully it's not just me that forgets to change um equipment because I've been doing that a lot recently forgetting to change my um equipment for a specific specific raid i should have probably even dropped headhunters too to, to help take a lot of drc so the warning could survive a little longer but we're gonna take our value as it comes so we got the well we got even more than value than expected can we get the other multi well the surprises ran away but we still but we still got it okay so we can change our plan because that side is gutted so let's just hit the, the this side is more naked, so we might as well hit the stronger side. That's just how I, I try to see it. Hit like the stronger side than the naked side, because this side is very gutted. This side is gutted, so I have, I have no need to, to go on this side. I have no need at all to go on that side, so let's just hit the stronger side. So let's go from there, and this, like I said, this base is triple already. Is is a triple already? I just put Yeti there. Well, the king is going over there. Probably didn't need Yeti, um, but this one is done already. You can see why this army is still so strong. Yes, it's a weaker base. It was a weaker base, but the super archers alone can just destroy a site. Even like the max style bases, super archers can still do decent decent work, and you can get easy with a triple. Even though it might not be that hard, but you can still be baited too. So. And even though it's an easy army to, to do, especially when it comes down to the super archers alone, it, it's not, it, you may not always be guaranteed with a triple because super, super archers can fail and you may not do bad enough. And you can see we're literally going to be swagging three hero abilities. I probably could be swagging the warden too, but I didn't draw headhunters up to take the DRC. I didn't think the warden would have gone that far, but he swagged three hero abilities and we were able to triple. So parches and the rewarders are just disgustingly strong. What can I say? And we're gonna be ending this war with 34 stars. Um when Clay does his hit, we'll be ending with 34. We need all the triples we can get. Wish it came down to a perfect war. That would have been 
that would have been great to have a perfect war on board A4 just to give us um, an edge. We probably won't promote, um, but we may just end off with uh, ending in second, um, second place. So that is what I'm hoping get. And that would be the best, the best plan of action, I say. But that's it, Nick. Hope you guys enjoyed the attack. See you guys next time.